Okay, 727, end of the day. Um, Scott was here this morning at uh, 930 this morning. He worked till 430 today. Um, basically, trying to get the body all squared up. Um, you see we got a brace right here, going from the top of the quarter, right down to the frame through the floor. Um, that was to hold that quarter there. We jacked that quarter up a little bit because it was sagging due to that body mount right there being blown out. It was about a quarter of an inch too low. Um, we got that set to approximately three quarters of an inch now, which is in depth, which is the same as this passenger side one here, which is about three quarters of an inch deep from the top of the surface here down to the bolt. About three quarters of an inch across down. So um, we're working on the driver's side tomorrow. Um, all the cross bracing is put in. You can see we've got cross bracing across the doors. Um, right up to the front. Um, in the middle and right across to the end. Roll it over here. Um, roll it again down here. And the floors are pretty toasty. And obviously that's why we're going through all this work. To do all this. Um, so yeah, I'm going to skate around real quick and get some footage from the driver's side. Um, Plenty of sheet metal to replace in this thing. Um, we had a pretty good day today, I think. Um, everything went really well. Uh, as far as the work that we completed, we had a lot of jacking and straightening to do. The passenger's door opened and shut just great, just excellent. Um, the driver's door gave us all kinds of problems. Um, we did find out that the striker plate on the original car uh, was really worn down, probably a good eighth of an inch down here off the top. Um, it was probably worn right down off. I don't have it in here right now, but this is one off one of the parts cars, um, one of the four doors. So this one seems to work much, much better, but the whole top right along here, this was completely wore right down. So this door problem sagging has been a problem for a long time, and we're not quite sure exactly what it was. Um, just yet we're loosening and doing some adjusting on the door up here doing some adjusting on the lower hinge as well down in here um, we got the door um, so it shuts decent and the gap is really nice all the way down so i think we're gonna have some more tweaking to do once we get the car down once we get the floors more stable and get it down back on the ground i think we have plenty more adjusting to do on the door uh, through the hinges so we won't know much about that. Probably the striker plate's going to have to be adjusted. All kinds of things have to be adjusted. Um, but we'll know more once we get the car back down on the ground and uh, can tweak the doors a little bit more. So the cross brace across here, you know, is really good. Nothing wrong with that. Um, all you can see all four mounts in the back here are blown out right down to the frame. So that was a major concern as far as the sag um, and the body. So we think that that's kind of what was going on. Um, definitely uh, first one for me like this that's this far so luckily I got a good friend of mine that um, can help me through this so um, we're going to go ahead tomorrow attack the driver's rocker inner and outer try to get some decent rockers on this thing so we can proceed with the floors and the bracing that goes underneath you can see the brace here that goes to the inner rocker right to the uh, floor through the floor is all completely gone so and then back here as well the brace that goes back here all the way through this body mount in is bad and then there's a brace that goes all the way along these two body mounts right to the center of the car so that's got to be replaced too and then we're going to get at that from underneath so we're talking about possibly lifting the car the body off the frame uh, prematurely i plan to anyways once the floors were done um, but we're talking about um, possibly lifting it up before that and uh, taking the body off the frame and seeing what we can do that way. Definitely make it a whole lot easier to get at all the underneath of the car. So um, I'll go ahead here and see if we can get this door shut and go from there. So the door shuts good. Um, gap looks pretty good all the way down. Happy with that. So, we got some tweaking to do there. She's up in the air right now. 
Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take it up a whole lot higher and um, for working on the rockers for tomorrow. So just a quick uh, estimate of video to see how she's coming along. The progress view of that door right there has got a little bit of a drag now. Um, again, I think it's because the body's a little tweaked right here and um, some of the mounts on this side is, is pretty weak too. So anyways, there's a video of her right there. Christine as of 727. 2020 hopefully this will be one good thing that comes out of 2020 anyways so we're going to sign off for now and we'll check back with you guys once we get some more progress done thanks